I'm currently cleaning house. I have contractual obligations, clothes to wear, supposed to do, <laughs> bills that have to be paid, showing up the best I can, right? Because I know that it's not going to be perfect. I know that people may have a gripe, but my arms are out. Finding clothes that are more aligned with where I'm headed, even if it's not to the book perfect. Mind you, we've been getting dreams, songs, angel numbers, that post that came across our feed that just so happened to apply to our situation. But we want the sign to be on the billboard in big red letters lit up with glitter. And it's almost as if we're waiting for this moment to feel ready. You're not gonna feel ready for something you've never done. That's why you have to get pushed. And we're also waiting for us to trust the outside world and the people in it. But a bird doesn't trust the branch it lands on. It trusts its wings. And you should do the same. You should do the same. Oh my gosh. Sorry, somebody had to echo. I'll, I'll, I'll take this off of her specifically. But this is why people don't fuck with religion. Because of people like her pushing it. Like, she said, I'm going to do this. But it's not going to be perfect. Because I got other obligations. Just like Christians that push religion. But you clubbing, sucking dick, and partying on Saturday. And then you go to church on Sunday morning. And most people that are religious that's this is how they move they 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 religious when it's, it's, they're religious when it's convenient for them and, and when it's not i mean i don't know if people are going to agree got, with I got, this I got, I got cut off i don't know why that happened but sorry go ahead i don't know nope i got cut off i'm fine i'm gonna go on mute like <laughs> jasmine does you got to meet um, I don't know how many people agree with this. I'm not saying I agree with her because I already saw flaws in a lot of the things that she said in that video with her in a car. Um, but Brittany Renner has to be one of the most smartest businesswomen out there. I mean, and every single day people are falling for it. And it's not what she's preaching that it's real. It's the pub it's the publicity the publicity that's getting her the money. Number one, Muslims don't do anything with synchronicity. So there was already a flaw in her statement. And if anybody knows the Muslim culture, the Muslim religion, they're not looking at numbers for God to tell them anything or Allah, whatever it is that they believe in. So this is just another ploy. This is just another tactic. And it gets people talking. I mean, we're here right now and we're talking about it. And there's going to be hundreds of others. And they're going to ask her to go on her show. She's going to make some a few bands. And she's going to talk about something she has no idea or no real belief in. Because I promise you, give it about a month, she's not going to be singing the same tune. And that's on fact. <laughs> so two, two things. I, I hate when y'all equate marketing to like a smart business person, okay? Um, all, all publicity ain't good publicity. If I go to the top of a mountain and scream out, I saw the dick. <laughs> that is not good publicity just because everybody heard it. Okay. So what Brittany <laughs> doing ain't she has no morals and no value. So yeah, it ain't good. But I do support Brittany because for years and years and years and years, and I yes, I am an atheist. This is what y'all grandmas did. They was a hoe for 40 years of their life and then gave herself to Allah or Jesus and God. So if y'all don't say <laughs> grandmama, don't say Britney. She just a girl trying to get it together. All right? Your grandma did the same thing. She was fucking all over town. Then she turned her life to the Lord, and you accepted her for it. So now Britney trying to get her wings and do right. Y'all need to resist, get her that same respect. You good religious people. Thank you. I think it's real. I think it's real. I believe her. And about, look, they ain't think it was real when your granny started going to church. Uh, nigga, I ain't talking, nigga. You ain't talking about me, and I wasn't talking I, about me. I said, I, I, said, I, I, said, I, I said, I think it's real. I ain't talking I said, about I said, you. I, said, I ain't talking about you personally, but y'all, they ain't think it was real when grandma started going to church and we knew she was fucking. No, I said, I said, I do think it's real, bro. I do think it's real. I believe okay. it. Okay. I just wish that it didn't, I just wish it didn't. I just wish she ain't have to do all the BS before trying to trying to stand trying to stand in it, saying yeah this is me I could be what I want to be it's good for it's good, and just realizing that no it's not good, it's not good because they all he made the money place. off it. It don't. I'm, That's the is, difference. Not, my thing is, I ain't, I'm not worried. I'm not talking about that. 
to be honest. I'm talking about the fact that she came to the realization that what she was doing before wasn't good for her. When I, I know she had people in her corner and she had the, her mind saying that it's not good for her. But you had to now you had to do all of the BS to come to the realization that it's not good for you and you influenced a lot of a big dog, women. big dog, big Who's dog. Who's to say that I'm she all, has though? Can I say no, I one thing? Can I say one thing? What, no, no, no. Ahead, what I'm, what, ahead, I'm, what I'm saying, what I'm saying is she just influenced a lot of young women to do BS just to come to the realization that the BS wasn't good. That's all. Go ahead, Litsa. Um, y'all remember that uh Just Pearly Things interview? I don't know, maybe it was a year or two years back. I mean, she literally sat there on the show and she held herself accountable um for about two hours on the show. Two hours. I mean, when we thought it was gonna be a combative conversation, it was just pearly things, you know, pretty much pointing out all her flaws. And she sat there and she was like, basically, you know. Okay, I'm gonna hold myself accountable. I'm trying to do better. But then, wasn't it like a few months ago where she just cursed just pearly things out on her podcast for just pearly things doing the same thing that she did the first time she interviewed her? We gotta stop falling for the okie doke. Come on, y'all. Like we, and, and this is why we continue to just viral down here. We are just so oblivious. Like our psychological game, we got to do better. And when I say y'all, I mean people in general who believe this. I'm not trying to make it a race thing. Um, but come on. <laughs> like come Well, on, we I can I could care less what Brittany Renner's doing, but since y'all are making me have to care, like this says it all, okay? <laughs> like that's it. Thank Next you, Carrie. <laughs> and, yeah. and the one and the one that's pinned is from five days ago so yeah yeah i was gonna say like i, I really don't think what she's doing is genuine it, it's she's i i don't know why she's doing it Brittany renner has done a lot and make sure she's always relevant some way somehow i think it's just for shits and giggles for likes views and a in a bag if she can check one i don't i don't believe it and it, I, and it really bothers me that she's now trying to associate herself with the Muslim religion, you know, to try to make herself, I don't know. I just don't like it. It, it gives me the, I think, I think the men keep it. No, I think so the, men, the men, the men keep it going. The men keep Brittany Renner going. Y'all are so judgmental. It's, I promise y'all, especially y'all cool. were just hey. talking about, y'all were just talking. <laughs> I'm, I'm confused. We, we just follow I'm the I'm so men. confused. If that's what y'all do. Love I it. guarantee that if you go inside of her comments, that it's a bunch of women in there. Oh, it's a bunch of women in there making comments because they're confused about what she's doing. I'm not saying that women are not like checking her, but y'all are keeping her steam going. Y'all are most definitely How? listen to listen to it, it's all women in the comments. Okay, I haven't came I, okay, okay, okay. Anton, tell us about Brittany. I'm three pages tell us, down. Tell us about <laughs> Brittany Renner. What do you want me to tell you about? Why are you smiling? <laughs> what do you want me to tell you? Should you should be disgusted. Why should I be disgusted? I'm not fucking her. I'm just saying, in the in the spirit of what we were talking about, and in mm -hmm. the spirit of like where the the women are, the men are, our culture is trash. Blah 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 blah. Mm -hmm. In the spirit of that, mm -hmm. she should kind of be on the "you're not good for us" list. Why would why would she be on that? Because it everything that she's representing seems to go against what the goal is for black men and women to come together for marriage for us to get back to more traditional to putting God at the center. She's mm. not like I don't, I don't believe in being in the echo chamber. I want to talk to everybody. No, not 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 talking. That's why I said that's why I said describe like talk to us about her because you could still sit down and listen to her, but when you start to go over her resume or like who she is, the first thing that a lot of men would likely do is smile. I mean, because and, the, the suckers is going to get finesse and the people that's not is not. I mean, listen, we're not talking about somebody that's new that just hit the scene. We're talking about somebody that has a long-standing reputation of what exactly the, the outcome is going to be. So if you the person like Coel, I hate to use him as an example, but no, that ain't me. The first one that was like, yeah, I believe it. Like, <laughs> believe it. Well, do you still, you still an example. It? Quite, quite. This is an Coel. example of why women will always never be able to be held accountable 
because there will always be. Oh well, no, that don't even that don't even them or believes them, and they gonna and they gonna do whatever they gonna do. You know what I'm saying? So as long as they have somebody that will always support them, listen. She don't have my support. I just said I believe her. Okay. I believe her because I, I know I'm using, I'm using. Listen, y'all, y'all like to take it too far. I'm using his belief in it as an example to illustrate. No matter what her history says, there's always going to be a guy that believes that that is a real transformation and that it's true. Oh, but I don't think that. I don't think that the, just because even if it is a real transformation that her past or anything that it makes her cool. I don't believe that. I just believe when I said I believe it. I just I was saying I believe that. I bet, a, a, a mental, I bet you would hit it. I bet you would hit it. I bet you would hit it. No, no, her history. No, I wouldn't. Cap. I Cap. Cap. I it. It. Oh my fucking god! Listen. The thing is, bro. I don't gotta lie, bro. If I would hit, I would hit. I, I didn't say you would lie. I just don't believe. I might you. get the hit. I might get the hit, but I won't. I oh, won't you get the head. You just not gonna beat it. Yeah, no, nah, I'm straight. You gonna straight? You straight on the belt? Okay, I got you. Come on, man. If I'm gonna be, if I'm gonna be one, y'all are, are 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 men really ready for women to not be of that culture anymore? The whole yeah. culture. Do men really no. want that to stop? The whole. Yeah. yeah. All of it. You know what I'm talking about. No, I don't know what I can say on YouTube, so you, you know, know what I'm talking about. They wouldn't be ready because it it works in their favor. Promiscuous women works for men. No, it no, it doesn't. Most men don't like. Most women don't like hoes. Most women don't like promiscuous women. We look at them some of some of the times. It looks nice visually, but so you know, why would you let her give you head? Though? Why would you let her give you head? Why are you getting the head? Why? Because it's Why something would you do. want that kind of mouth on you? Because it's something to do with his mouth. The thing is, the thing is, the thing is, it's okay for you to give you some. But her what? mouth is okay. Why? Why? Well, see, that's a whole different you conversation. Those two different, those two different things. Because I'm still a man. So that has you're nothing to do. That has nothing to do. Still a man. Nothing. That has nothing to do with nothing. So you said just, because just, you're a man. Just because I said I would let her give me head, word? that has nothing to do. That has nothing to do because uh, 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 since the beginning of time, hold on, listen. Since the beginning of time, there has been harlots and everything. Just, <laughs> most so women, most just you gotta no listen sense. for a second. Most women wasn't out here thotting around. That's be, that's a new thing within the last Cap. thirty to forty years. Not true. Most women wasn't out here the whole travel, bro. Man, man I'm true. talking, man, 200, 200 years ago. Yes, six women out here around. Yes, it was. Like it was literally. So you think they were literally how they was in the now? Bible? So you it think was in the Bible? Bible. So you think how they was in the Bible? Man, I'm not. No, nobody saying that. Nobody. First of all, nobody saying that there wasn't harlot. So we ain't gonna do that. I'm asking a specific question. I'm saying, like, like it is now. Are you saying? Yes. We just didn't have social media to. to Look at to see it. I don't. I don't. I don't agree with that. I don't agree with that. How do you don't agree with, that? Don't don't agree with, with it? it? Listen, since the beginning, I, I, I agree there was. It's always been hoes. What are you talking yes, about? That's what right. I said. I agree there. There have always been hoes, but I don't think there has been a, the same percentage of hoes that there is now. I don't believe that it was always that high. Well, you think saying. it was just some? Yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Okay. So you think it was just some special right. hoes? Man, cut it out. Man. Specialized. We ain't about to. We ain't about to play this game, bro. Like we ain't about to play this game, like. The thought culture hasn't become big over the last uh, twenty to thirty years, bro. Now, if you're gonna tell Our me that chicks, in the, if, you, if you're gonna tell me that, so if you're gonna tell me that chicks in the sixties and fifties was as promiscuous as women Hell now, yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Hell Hell yeah. Maybe that's why they was having two kids. No, what, dog, you need to go and talk to these some of these old OG girls. Um, the oh, need for sex is, I know, bro. Is a, is I know. at this point. I mean, come on. Pablo, so, you want to agree with that too? Uh, you agree with that too? Agree Hello, with everybody. That too? What's up? What, what, you look like uh, oh, the dude off the phone head, Pablo. We, we going to get to oh, Pablo. Good, gonna, so, hold on, so, Pablo. Hold on one so, second. So, 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 hold on, y'all. Hold on. They can't hear us if we all talking at the same time. We going to get to Pablo. Coel, what'd you say? One last. So, woman, woman, y'all agree with that too? Y'all agree with that? that woman? So, that woman yes. was as promiscuous as they are now in the 60s and 50s? Okay, yes. You said, yeah. What about what about you, uh, Carrie? No, I I would I would not say, I would not say in the same way. No. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. No. What about you? Crazy. Um, Them no. hoes was nasty. No, no. The they was not let me let me tell you something. I mean, they I was got, nasty. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me let me tell you something. Uh, I, no, I know for a fact. Yeah. I used to talk to my OGs in a plant, and when I got into the plant. This was like 2000, 2001, right? 
And you had OGs that was in there 50, 60, 70 years old. And they was telling me like, yo, like you hear the stories of every single thing that these, let me tell you something. When Janae Aiko said, talked about eating groceries, that shit was old to these old hoes. Yeah, these but old, I'm, listen, I'm, I'm talking about to the similar, magnitude. Ain't no, yes, bro. Yes. Listen. You ain't never I, seen I, I don't Freak, Freak Nick in 96, 95, 94. Them hoes was doing some of the wildest shit that we've ever seen in our lives. Yeah, I said, yeah, yeah. My husband, let me tell you yeah. something, bro. Hold on, hold on. 94, yeah. I believe boy, in 94, yeah. I, dog, you from Detroit. And on Bell Howe in the early 90s, them hoes was fucking in the dark. I, I, I said the 50s and 60s, bro. The 90s, we can. I can no, you I can said agree the, with first that. First of all, first you said the last. I said it's got. I, first I said you it said, got popular first you in said, the 20, 30 years. First you said the first, last 20, 30 years. Yeah, I got the last 20, 30 years. Bro, these whole... Man, let me tell you something, bro. Some of y'all daddies ain't even y'all daddies. Hey, I believe that. I believe that. They I believe been, that about a lot it's of been since the beginning of time, bro. Go, go and watch any of these documentaries. Bro, I, bro, I believe... Bro, bro, I know it was hoes. For go, and watch, go and watch some of these wild Western movies. They had whole, whole houses. I know it. But I don't think that he's saying... But those was the only I, hoes in the city. It at that, wasn't. At that it bro, wasn't. You had, you had a small town. Like, say if you had a small town. It wasn't, bro. It'd be one whole house in that city, bro. It's not. That's, it wasn't. Okay. I'm it talking wasn't. about in like the 1930s, but okay. I do my research. I, I, I definitely think that you can see it. You can see a lot more, more easily these days than you could when they I was advertised themselves up. back then. Carrie, it was very blatant. But what... I'm not saying that there were not people who did that. I'm just saying in terms of the numbers, I think that you're more likely to see that going to the grocery store now than you would even when I was a little girl. When I like yeah. I no, I would yeah. no. Some of the no yeah. some of the some of the stuff I don't that, no, no, this ain't even this, this ain't even a subject that that's that women gonna, just stuff this that, ain't even a subject that's gonna go viral and no shit like that. Like it's not new. Whole it's is, whole We're not saying extreme. it's new. No, y'all ain't never even y'all never y'all never read the Scarlet Letter. No, it's we're, not, we're not saying that. What y'all doing? We're y'all, not what was y'all doing? It didn't exist. We it, he said more. It's more now. We're not saying it wasn't then and now. The difference today is that now. it's celebrated now. It's, it's celebrated like, today, no, but I don't no, think that the no, number no, has ever changed. No difference is now we have social media to see it. With our yeah. own eyes and places that we otherwise wouldn't have been available to see it at. It's always been there in every capacity, in every city, in every state across the country. It's always in every country in the world. It's always been there. And, and to, the reason why, not as much as it is, but Carrie, and, hold, on, hold, on, hold on, hold on, hold on. How do you know? How do you know not as much as it is? Because, because now you can't even. I want him to be able to answer. How does he? Know? I can answer it for him. No, I don't need you. No, I don't, I don't, need, you. He don't, I don't need that. How do you know that. not as much as it is? You could tell in the way things are. You could listen to the stories from. The thing is, a, a different. I'm different from most people in a lot of ways. But like, I grew up with my grandparents, my great grandparents. So like, I've listened to stories. I know it was hoes out there, but I know that the attitude was different when it came to sex you know what i'm saying so i i know that it was hoes but and so the reason it, it, right, 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 bro right right now it's bro you would see a grandma a mama and a daughter they all out here thotting around all small short and they was all, all thotting around back then Man,